So the AMA MFA program stands out for its more intimate, uh, small, personalized community. Um, and the idea that we are here as artists um, to develop a writing practice, not to engage with the competitive aspect of the literary world, but as fellow artists with our students grappling with the same issues of how to how to do this, how to to practice this art um, in a sustainable way, in a way that is developed within a supportive community. We have a very diverse group of people. We have diversity in race, age, gender, and not just male, female. We do have representation from all communities. Well, I don't necessarily want to be in, in, in with everybody's like me. Everybody looks like me, walk like me, talk like me, think like me, because I don't grow. Yeah, we take two trips up to the very famous Asabo River, and they learn the basics of fly fishing. And trout can only live in beautiful places, so the water is clean. The environment is just spectacular. And so, it, frankly, it's not really about fly fishing. <laughs> it's about beautiful places and how do we take care of them. I came to Alma College because of Sophronia Scott. You know, I got to know her before there was a program. And, you know, I wanted to learn writing from her. She was just, she's just fabulous. I mean, she's gentle, kind, powerful, determined, deep. I mean, just so many powerful adjectives. And so when she said that, you know, she was going to be directing this program, I said, well, I want to improve my writing. And you're writing and publishing books, articles, and, you know. So I said, where can I sign up? We offer three genres, fiction, creative nonfiction, and poetry. A student can go through their whole time at the MFA in one genre, or they can do a dual genre in which they do three terms in their major and two terms in their minor. We also offer the opportunity because some students come wanting to study fiction and fall in love with poetry, so we give them the option to try one term in a second genre if they wish. So my background is a little bit non-traditional. Um, first generation college student, and I also uh, served six years in the Air Force and another six years in the National Guard. Uh, I chose to come to the Alma College MFA program because I was looking for a program that uh, was a little bit flexible in nature and timing. I've been trying to write a book for about 10 years or so, and I saw this as a way of keeping me on schedule. Earning an MFA is a decision of the heart as much as the head and you have to honor that for students, to understand that there is a reason why they've come here and to help them on that journey to becoming the writer that they want to be.